somewhere else in the back rooms. I'm all this day and wait a second. Wait. Uh, I'm at the hub. I'm at the hub. Yes, the one that can head to different levels. Maybe I can find the exit here. But didn't it say there was only access to level 0, 1, and 2? I guess I'll find out soon enough. I can immediately confirm 0. Hello. Hi. A new person has found their way to the hub. Welcome to my little store. I trade different drinks. I see. So you've got like water, lemonade, and a raspberry drink it seems. Yes, that's why I sell. You also can buy some from that vending machine over there. Over where? Oh yes, over there. I see. Alright. But I guess I'll need money for that machine. Yes. So you either can trade items with me or head over there. Alright. But um, this is the hub? Yes, this is the hub. What's your name? My, my name's Michael. Um, sorry for my flashlight. It's quite dark in here. Yeah, I understand why you would be using a flashlight here. It is quite dark. There aren't a lot of light sources. Yeah. But, um... I guess I'll further investigate. One quick question. Does this um, hub have access to more than level 0 to 2? Yes, indeed. Oh, that's good to know. Alright, see you later. See you, Michael. Huh. Yes. Yeah, looks like this place is quite popular. Lots of people around the place and all the levels I've been through so far uh, uh, level of unknown hey can I ask you about that mysterious door ah uh, yes we've fucked that off because we yet to determine it if it's safe or not. Plus there's a figure at the end of that tunnel way. A figure? What do you mean? Oh, I can kind of see it. Yeah, right at the end of the hallway. That is very ominous. It looks like it's almost heading towards us, yet not moving at all. That's odd. Yes, anyone that's approached the figure has disappeared and no one's come out the door. We've sent people there in squads before but no one's returned. Alright, and I guess it's best I don't try it. Yes, that would be wise. Alright, well, see you, um, I'm gonna continue to investigate, alright, stranger. Okay, let's further go in, yep, more of the areas, more people, and looks like there's supplies scattered all over the place, I guess. Some of the supplies are communal, I guess. Hey, quick question. What supplies are communal? Usually the stuff to decide that the traders don't own. The traders often are the economy of this place, so their stuff is for sale where 
you can pretty much choose whatever house that's found. So, like those books over there, you can just read them at your own leisure. Not much use, but at least they'll provide you with, with a small amount of entertainment. Yeah, yeah. Well, thanks for answering my question. Oh my. Uh, what is that? Is that a bomb? Yeah, this looks like a bomb. Yep, this looks like a military grade explosive. Damn. And looks like fuel and stuff. Hello there. Hi. Um, I guess you're selling gas and other materials. Yes, indeed. Do you want to buy? No thanks. I'm just going to further investigate. Yep, every level I've been to so far has been down this hallway. I've been through level zero to eight already. Hi there. Hi. Don't head to the graveyard. Everyone that goes to the graveyard disappears. The graveyard? Oh my. That's ominous. Yeah, don't head to it. Alright. I will not head to the graveyard. Alright, another store with food. Damn, I could use some food. Oh, I haven't had food in forever. I've also drank, but oh man. At least I have like my cantina that has water with it. So I've been able to drink from it a little bit at a time to at least when I did get thirsty, but food I have not had. Hi there. Hello. You want some food? Everyone always seems to want food in this place. Yeah, I would like some food. Alright then, um, what have you got? Because that's how we work. Traders trade for something. Well, I don't really have anything other than guns. Oh. How many guns do you have? A lot of guns. I'm a military person as you probably can tell. Yes, I can see from your armor that you're not exactly like the regular group that has ended up in the back rooms. You seem like you're a lot more prepared than others with a flashlight, armor, weapons. You look like you were prepared to head in the back rooms. In fact, I was. This was a mission I was sent on to investigate. Why would you want to investigate a place like this? And who would know about this place? Well, there's this little group. Well, not exactly little, but this group known as the Foundation. I'm a part of it. And um, we investigate anomalies. And, um, yeah, it's a job to do so. Huh. Alright. Uh, protection could be useful. Uh, but, hmm, um, I don't know. It's not exactly going to help me now that I'm in the hog. I don't think I'll take any of your guns. I'll just give you here, this snack bar that I found at one point recently that seems fresh still doesn't seem like it's gone past its expiry date so it'll probably be fine. Do you have anything else that might interest me? Um, I have some coins and stuff if you want it for that snack bar. Yeah, I might as well take that for the trade because it's useful to have at least something. So, yeah, I'll take those coins. Here you go, and I'll take the snack bar. Thanks for the trade.
No problems. Oh, I hope you can find a way through your pla this place. It's often confusing, yeah. Hopefully I can save the people that are here one day. I still have to find the exit myself. Yep. We're all still trying to find the exit. Some have been here longer than others. It's a struggle, but the harbour is the best place to be, mm, indeed. I'm going to continue on. I think I need to try and find the exit. Yep, indeed. Huh, the hive. Well, I know exactly what's in there. That is not where I want to go. I'm lucky to avoid it so far. Uh, looks like we've got some bathroom stuff around here. Yep, toilets. Oh, the hi. So these are the toilets. Yep, we've put them together. Not the best work, but at least these toilets work. We have no idea where our waste is going, but it's still better than nothing. Yeah, yeah. Well, I wish you luck. Yes, we all need it. Hey, that's where I just was. The end, except that's a lie. Hey, look, more supplies. Looks like milk and other stuff like radiation pills. Damn, interesting. Oh, the Hello, you look quite different to a normal citizen that has wandered through here. Yeah, I'm a part of a military organization, sort of. It's not tied to the military, but, um, yeah, I'm, I'm Michael. Well, hello, Michael. Are you interested in any of my radiation gear, everyone always goes for the radiation tablets slash vitamin tablets. They help out a lot in this place. I, I think I'm good. Do you know what else is beyond the like walls of the hub? I've seen quite a lot of blockages so far areas that have been just left quarantined up. Usually those areas aren't explored. We're lucky to be here in a place where we have easy access to level 4 and luckily from the knowledge that has been gained we know how to get back to the hub easily at this point. Yeah. It's good to have useful knowledge. I guess those data tunnels over there must be the cores of all the data. Wait, are those the ones that are communicating with the outside world? Yeah, unfortunately we lost internet access to the real world some time ago. We've tried to find someone that could help us but no one's came through. Maybe I can give it a shot. Having more up-to-date information for the real world could be useful. And especially since I could still be here for a while, it's definitely needed. So I'm going to help out. Alright. Hey there. Hey. These are the diatonals for the information that we have on the back rooms. May I quickly use this USB that I've got to take a copy of any of the data? Sure, I guess. And I've heard that you have a problem with um, the internet, yes. Well, let me help out here. I have some special training and abilities that might be able to help me out. 
Alright, let's see if um, Bing Bong Bip use a little bit of my anomalous powers, zap, and in it, access back up and fully functional. You've saved us. Well, not exactly, but you've saved so many lives by allowing the updated information to go public. Yes. I hope it will help. Oh, it's definitely helped. Thank you. That's alright. And anyway, when I'm going to take my USB of the copy of the information and move on. But thank you. You should quickly talk to our other technician, notify him that you were the one that did it. Alright. Hey. Hi. Did you just fix a Wi-Fi issue, I internet issue? Yeah, I did. Thank you. I'm glad to see someone knows something about it. I've had a little bit of internet training myself, like technical stuff, but I've been stumped for a while and haven't had a help in a long time. What's your name? My name's Michael and um, I'm a part of the SCP Foundation. The SCP Foundation? I thought those guys were just a rumor. You guys are real? Yeah, we're real. We're kind of um, dealing with a lot of stuff recently, but otherwise we're real. We're very real. Wow. An uh, actual foundation member here. And not to less a real one and confirming that the foundation is real. Wow. This is a crazy day. But I guess this place has been so strange and weird that I'm glad that I'm still alive. Yeah. Well, I hope you the best now that you have full access again. That'll help out greatly. Thank you. Alright. See you later. Alright. Looks like they're regaining control of um, cameras. Huh. My help has really helped out. And a door to the hub. While I'm already here, I wonder if this is true. Are you? Yes. Is this door truthfully true? Yep, it does. Tell the truth, it leads to the hub. But the one caveat is it leads to a random part of the hub. Sometimes it'll lead back to red light where a lot of people enter, but otherwise there's a chance there you will just magically go to a different part of the tunnels of the hub and this is quite dangerous but can be worth it if you're looking for something more particular than there is in the main hub area as the sub hub areas also sometimes prove to have useful items, but getting back to main hub will mean you have to take one of the doors to one of the other levels that are available in those sub areas. I see. So what levels are available in those sub areas? Level 13, 14, and 15 is in one of the two sub areas, one of we lost contact with sub area 3 a few days ago which we're very concerned about but um, we have to just move on and hope for the best for them yeah you can't really do that much what about the other one? the other one leads to level 19, 20, and 21. Alright. 
I don't know too much about those levels. Neither does a lot of people. The information is quite limited on those levels. Yeah. And I guess not many people would return. Yeah. And I guess anyone that does return might not be mentally the most sane, I guess, going through this place. Yeah, indeed. Well, I hope that information can help you, stranger. Yes, it helps a lot. Thank you. Alright. Getting further in. Wow, an actual vehicle for once. That's quite nice. Hey there. There's a door that says exit. I'll investigate in a second. And that other area too. Hello. Hi there. We're trying to sell this car to anyone that wants to buy it. But um, of course a car that's functioning does have a very high price to it. We want a lot of things if we're going to sell this. Yes, me and my husband have been trying to sell this car but no one has quite enough materials for us to be satisfied to sell it because of course we could use it but we haven't decided yet if we do want to investigate the other areas. Yeah, we're still very much doubtful that we'll find anything but we still have the option if the gate man allows us to drive through. Mm, yes. Well, um, I have a number of guns and weapons and um, protection items on me like my SEP powers could also potentially create objects for you so um, yeah I could provide some objects that could be useful to you guys if I were to want to buy this. I haven't decided yet because I still want to investigate that and I assume you're probably not going to sell this anytime soon. Yeah, we're not going to sell this probably anytime soon. No one's ever had enough materials to satisfy us. Like, we've tried to sell it, but we want thorough amount of stuff. But you look like you're one that has a lot to offer. I mean, with that boy armor, and it looks like you have multiple weapons that could protect us. It definitely could be a worthy transaction. Yes, it does seem like you'd be the first one we could actually trade this to. Hmm. Well, let's leave this trade off on a maybe for later. I still want to further investigate. Like, this is probably one of the only two doors I want to investigate that I've seen. Otherwise, I'll, if I do so, I'll come back here using the information I've gained from the USB drive that I now have in my possession that has the information on the back room. So I'll leave this trade offer here and say that I'd definitely be willing to trade all of my stuff for that vehicle because I could just probably replace a lot of it anyway. Hmm. Yes. What's your name, stranger? My name's Michael. I hope that we can meet again in the future. Yes, indeed. Well, see you later, Michael. Yes, see you. Don't worry. I'm highly certain that I will trade with you guys for it. What's this way before I investigate that door? Oh, it looks like some old area. Looks like a, it's an old storage area. Oh, uh, yes. This is an old area with 
lots of the broken down stuff that we've yet to fix and um, we just lock it off just in case because there's that small opening as you probably can see in the rubble yes I see so we've locked this area off just for the general safety I see anything that you've seen from it we've heard things we've never actually seen anything I doubt the creatures that lurk would try and attack somewhere like the hub because even though it might not be obvious to you but we do have some like guards that do usually defend the hub at the moment they're currently collecting supplies in level 4 which is the most heavy on supplies as you may know if you've went through it yes I did go through it um, me I didn't really managed to have a lot of time to get supplies. It was a nice place but I didn't stick around very long. Hmm, yes. Anything you did collect from there? Oh yeah, I did get a cup of hot coffee like that was still on like one of the cabinets there. I drank that and it was pretty good. Hmm, yes. It often has the best coffee in the whole back rooms that level. It's strange how the coffee always seems fresh, but things are strange in the back rooms, so we don't question it. Yeah. Alright, I'll see you later. Um, and, um, yeah. Um, good luck. Wish you'd Fuck to stranger. Alright, exit. Hey, yo. Hello. This is the exit door. We have yet to see anyone come back from this door. As you probably seen, there was that mysterious level unknown door early in the main hub that you probably saw behind a fence. This door, only known as the exit, has only been tested by a few people and no one has ever returned. They've seemed like they're mysteriously vanished, not to be seen again. Uh, I've heard from some reports of people that usually that there's a supposed door in the back rooms known as the exit which led them back out to the real world. They didn't always end up being a little bit crazy as they don't feel like it is the real world but it is. Wait, you're telling me this door might be the truthful exit? Or uh, according to the sources and what my foundation have learned, um, there's supposed to be a door called the exit from my research before I went here to investigate. So you're telling me this might just be the exit and the freedom for everyone here. Yes, maybe, but I've yet to determine if it is the exit or not because yeah again I'm here to try the doors and see how to save the people that have been trapped in here hmm indeed well if you do go in if you come back I will know that finally my time here has come to its end but what will happen if everyone leaves the hub? The hub will be empty and vacant and anyone else here might not know of the exit is really the exit. Don't worry, 
as I have mentioned, I'm a part of a foundation, a group known as the SEP Foundation. We specialize in dealing with anomalies such as this mysterious realm known as the back rooms. So you're specialized in the unknown, correct? Yes, indeed. That is what I do with my foundation. And if this really does lead to exit, soon the foundation will quickly occupy the back rooms and with the information that I've gained from those tunnels back there, hopefully I can save as many lives as possible in these back rooms. You could say who knows how many lives have ended up in this place and if they do get a hub and your foundation is here to help them out, that could definitely work. Yeah, so my foundation will have turns in just being here to act as the new hub, a hub run by the foundation. Hmm. Well, then go ahead, go try it, and if you come back here, I'll be happy to know that I can finally be free. Yes, you can hopefully finally be free. Alright, I think I'm ready to head through the door. I don't think the other door is going to help me and I don't want to head to the high, so finally, heading through the exit, here I go. I hope for the best. Ah! Oh god, it's dark. I thought I had my flashlight. Oh my. The exit. Yep, I just went through the door. Aimed exit. I don't know where I am. I'm in dark room. Oh, don't tell me I'm still in the back rooms. Uh, fences. They're locked. There's a something. Uh, born. I don't know what that means. Uh, no. There's a slight light coming from this way. Uh, these fences seem familiar somehow. I don't know why. This one's broken. Mm. Oh. Light and a way out. Hey, it looks like outside. Wait a second. I recognize this place. Wait a second. I definitely recognize this place. This is the O5 Councils. It's the O5 Council building. I'm back. I'm back! How can I tell this is real? I need to get up there now and see if the O5 Council is up there. Oh my lord. I need to head upstairs. They usually have this area just without people so that no one suspects anything like the illusion that it's a band of plates. Obviously there's one of systems, but up the stairway I go, I guess. Alright, I've headed up the stairs now. Oh my. I'm back! I'm really back! Michael? Is that you? You've been missing for lost few days ever since you started your back rooms expedition. We're finally back. We've lost contact with you so long ago. Oh my god, I'm back. Tell me I'm really back. You need to prove to me I'm actually back. Michael, you're back. Calm down. Oh my lord. 
I'm on my knees. Oh my word. Uh, the O5 council, they here. Oh my word. Guys, you're here. Yes, Michael, what's... Wait, Michael? Oh my, we thought... Oh my lord, for a second, it just seemed like we were going to have a normal checkup, but we forgot you've been missing. Oh my, how has it been, Michael, in the bathrooms? Oh my god, it's been so long I've been in there, but the guards said I was only gone a few days. What? Have you been gone longer? I think I've been gone much more longer than a few days. I was in there for so long. Oh my lord. Okay, O5, I'm so glad to see you all. You're all here. And now I have the information needed. This USB stick. That'll help us finally save the people trapped in the back rooms. Oh my lord. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. We're glad you're back, Michael. I see your adventures in the back rooms have probably been eventful. Oh my, there, there's so much to talk about. But now I've gone through hell and I've come back. I'm finally back. I'm finally free of the back rooms. But isn't there one thing about the back rooms that once you leave you always come back? Yes, it seems to be a strange curse with the back rooms where inevitably you always end up back there. But at least now I can be prepared next time and be free a lot more quicker than this. Thank God I'm back. I, I'm so happy. I'm so glad. It's just so good to see actual people. Oh my lord. I'm so torn. But I can save the people now. Yes. Indeed. Welp. We can finally put this case to its end and send a foundation MTF squadron in to save the citizens. Thank God. Thank God. Alright. Uh, it's so good to be back. It's good to see you again, Michael. Anyway, we'll contact an MTF squadron as soon as possible. You better upload that dial, Michael. Yep. Here's a copy of it. And I'll start uploading immediately while I have my chance. Uh, it's so good to be back. I hope not to return in too soon. Oh my lord. It was a nightmare. We can imagine, Michael. We can imagine. But anyway, I'm going to get some rest. Head back home, I guess. Whatever you could consider home after that experience, but I'm back here on Earth, actual Earth. So that's all that matters to me, and I can finally rest easy. Yes, go get some rest, Michael. Yep, see you later, O5 Council. Oh my lord. See you, MTF Gods. See you, Michael. Uh, I'm so glad it's over. The end is finally here. The final end of the back rooms. Thank God. Oh my lord. The end. Uh.